Hey guys, it's J-Man and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a Dollar Tree slime review. As some of you might know, last week I made my own homemade slime. And this week we will be comparing Dollar Tree slime to my homemade slime. Let's get into it. So here we have all of our slimes. So the first slime we're going to be opening, ladies and gentlemen, it's called Rainbow or Cake Slime. So if you open it, oh, if you open the top part, there's little sprinkles. And I guess you just open it right here. Oh, and already I'm seeing some fluff. This is the slime, so let's take it out. It came out a little watery. That disappoint. Ah. It does smell like cake, though. But it's a really watery. But it is really stretchy and really fluffy. And it's not sticky at all. So that's the birthday cake slime. And we're going to put the sprinkles on it. Where'd those sprinkles go? Oh shoot, do you have the scissors? Well, I'm just going to rip it open. Let's mix in the sprinkles. Now it's birthday cake slime. That's the birthday cake slime. Now let's open another one and check. Actually, let's compare this one to mine. This one's stretchy and not sticky. And this is mine. Mine's a little sticky, but it is stretchy. Mine can make bubbles. I'll show you that later. Let's see if this one can. Nope, no bubbles. Well, that's disappointing. Let's check out one of the other slimes. Next, we're gonna open Cotton candy. So let's get right into it. Oh, this one comes with more sprinkles. This one comes with star sprinkles. Now let's get into this review. Now let's get into it. Now right away I can tell this is really sticky. It is probably deactivated. Yeah, this is really deactivated. For real. Ew. Yeah, no. It's... This one's really deactivated. I can't play with it. It's really deactivated. It's so deactivated, you guys. Look at that. I'm gonna put the lid back on that one. Can't do the sprinkles, it's deactivated. Let's get into our next slime. The next slime we'll be opening is our sprinkle donut. Now let's see what kind of sprinkles this one has. Oh, Homer Simpson sprinkles. Let's get in, let's get into it. Let me wipe my hands off. That last slime was a bit watery. If you know what I mean. Now right away. Wow. 
It's a nice yellow color. It's a little sticky, but it's really stretchy. It's actually a lot sticky. This one's a little sticky. But as you can see, if I play with it more, it won't be so sticky. It looks like butter. Now let's put the sprinkles in. Sprinkles. Now I forgot how to open this. Let's put these little sprinkles in there. Whoa. Now look at those sprinkles incorporate. So, you gotta love that donut slime. It's a little sticky, but you gotta love it. So let's go on to the next slime. Wrong lid, everyone. My bad. Okay, the next slime we'll be trying out is our Orbs Crunchy Candy Slime. Let's see. Oh, it's got these kind of sprinkles in it. Iridescent metallic sprinkles. Let's open it. This one, oh. Well, it's not watery like the last one was. And it's pretty good. Let's take it out and play with it. And it's two colors. And it smells really good. Would you look at that, ladies and gentlemen? It's metallic. It's metallic. Now let's put it back in here and put the sprinkles in it. Yes, and it's good for making bubbles. And you can see it does not stick to my hands. Can we get a shot of this lovely slime here? It's lovely. Now where are those awesome, awesome, awesome sprinkles? Let's do this. I don't know how to open this one. Well, maybe I'll just put these in there later. Because it won't work. Let's sprinkle these sprinkles in there. Get them all in there. There's a few that couldn't come out of the bag. Just get those little buggers in there. And now, we push them down. And we mix it in there. See, a lot of them came out. We just wipe those in there. Get those, make sure they go in there. And there you have it. Ready? Let's go, let's move on to the next slide. That's not how you close it. My bad. Okay, the next slime that we will be reviewing 
is ice cream fluff, strawberries and cream. And look at this thing in this one. They look like little pink Finding Nemo eggs. Now let's get into the slime review, y'all. Leave a comment down below what you think. And this one smells really good. Whoa, look at that color, ladies and gentlemen. Precision, precision, precision. And it's so fluffy and so stretchy. You'll love every bit of the plank with Dollar Tree slime. I gotta say, Dollar Tree slime isn't as bad as I thought it would be. I actually like it. I give it a thumbs up. A 10 out of 10, 100 out of 100. I recommend buying Dollar Tree slime. Now this one, it was a little watery, but all the slimes are good. So maybe a little watery, but you just gotta activate them. That's all you do. Let's get into putting the sprinkles in this. Ready, y'all? Get those little buggers in there. Okay, I got them all in there. Now let's fold it all in. Whoa. Look at that slime stretch. You see all that, how that slime stretches, y'all? Now let's get into the last and final review of the night. We have Rainbow Sherbert ice cream, basically. Slime. Look at the top. Oh, it's a real chunky, chunky. And for this one, we have these little cubes. These little foam cubes to put in there. Let's get into it. Let's get into the review. So right away when I opened it, it's not... It is not a fluffy slime like I thought. And it is really, really sticky. By the way, it's really sticky. It's not watery, but it is really sticky. <sighs> it's really sticky and it leaves kind of a colory residue. It's really sticky though, but if you look at it when you drop it on the table, oh, if you look at the slime on the table, it looks really cool, huh? And now I'm gonna put the foam beads in there, the little foam squares. It's really sticky slime. Can you open these for me? Let's get into it.
Whoa, look at those little foam squares get in there. This little bugger right here keeps sticking on. Now let's mix it in there as much as we can. Whoa, look at that. Now let's put her back in her slime case. Well folks, that was my slime review. I think... Want me to play with this one? Let me just... Wipe my hands off. Now let's review my slime. Now all those slimes... Now all those slimes are amazing and great. But my slime... Let's show you what my whole base line can do. It may be a little sticky, but you know what? You hear that crunch, ladies and gentlemen? That sizzle? Whoa. And this is my whole base line. Remember, ladies and gentlemen, if you're wondering if Dollar Tree Slime is good, it is. It is incredible. It's amazing. Homemade Slime's good too, you guys. Ta da! Thank you guys for watching. See you next week with J Man. And this has been a slime review. Thanks for watching.